Innovation is the cornerstone of success in America. In order to compete in the global marketplace, businesses and individuals are continuously striving to stay ahead of the game. I'm Terry Bradshaw. You know, from emerging technologies and financial strategies to the latest healthcare developments, you would be surprised by the many factors coming into play. Welcome to Today in America. American industry is striving every day to become bigger, faster, and better. It's gone beyond the doorstep of the local production plant, crossing continents and oceans to span a breadth of new technologies, processes, and innovations. Join me as we explore the inner workings of an American industry. A wide variety of aircraft take to the world skies each day. The class of planes privately owned and typically used for business and owner-flown personal travel is considered general aviation. Like every other part of the economy, the general aviation market has been depressed for several years and, as a result, much of the industry has endured layoffs, plant closures, and the abandonment of production plans. The current general aviation market is uh, soft like many other markets in today's economy. However, uh, with the introduction of some of the single-engine aircraft that are uh, on hold for the next couple of years, we think this is a ripe opportunity to reintroduce the Eclipse 500 aircraft back into the marketplace. For the creators of the brand new Eclipse light jet, the economic downturn signaled a complete halt to production and defaulting of the company. This was a unique aircraft with capabilities that rival larger, more complicated jets, yet scaled down to a light, ultra-versatile craft that was well poised to address a wide range of purposes. Here in Albuquerque hangar sat rows of Eclipse aircraft in various stages of completion, simply abandoned like some mysterious archaeological site. Over the last year, that has begun to change. Currently, Eclipse Airspace is uh, in a healthy position. We acquired the company in September of 2009. We've spent a lot of time over the last year reestablishing service and support for our existing 260 aircraft owners. And we're now excited to reintroduce our new products into the marketplace for 2010 and beyond. A very light jet is a class of aircraft that weighs in at 6,000 pounds or less. Even flying at 400 miles per hour, the Eclipse 500 only burns twice the fuel of an SUV traveling at 60 miles per hour. In general aviation, there's three types of customer markets. You have a charter individual uh, flights, you have corporate travel, and you also have private travel. In all of these cases, different organizations and individuals are looking for more cost-effective and economical ways to travel. The Eclipse aircraft traveling uh, over 1,000 nautical miles with three passengers or less really fits that bill. The Eclipse 500 jet is capable of flying at 41,000 feet, has a top speed of 370 knots or about 425 miles per hour and a range of 1,200 nautical miles. Its fuel consumption is better than 30% below anything else in its class and the operating costs for the plane are 30 to 40% lower than comparable aircraft. The capability of taking off and landing on runways as short as 3,000 feet opens up much of the world to those who fly this plane. The Eclipse 500 is a unique plane in that it offers all the traditional benefits of jet travel, convenience, safety, uh, time efficiency, but it's much more economical. It is by far the least expensive jet in the world today to travel in. The 260 Eclipse 500 jets that have been in operation up till now have logged over 50,000 flight hours without a personal injury accident. The company is offering an array of programs for existing owners to continue operating their aircraft as well as upgrade options. Plans are in development for restarting production of the Eclipse 500 jet aircraft. The Eclipse 500 future is very bright. Over 70% of all travel in private aviation today involves trips of less than 750 nautical miles carrying passenger load of four or less, making the Eclipse 500 twin-engine jet the most economical method of travel in jet aviation today.